Hello, thank you for joining me. My name is Pa, and I will be introducing my 10-day final project with Dub Code Camp. My application is called Refresh My Style. It is a social platform that will allow users to upload um, images of clothing items that they would like to give away or share. So the reason why I created this app is because every year there are billions of clothes that um, go into the landfill, and uh, that's not very eco-friendly. So I think this app would be a great tool to try to prevent that and also just provide a fun environment for um, people to come together and exchange clothes. The main um, technology used to create this app is ASP.NET Core MVC framework, as well as the entity framework. Um, the data is stored with the um, SQL Server database, and the main uh, programming language is C Sharp. So I've created a few users already. You just hop in to uh, the first one. As soon as you log in, you'll see your profile picture and your name. You can go down to create here and upload a new selfie. You can also create um, a new item, upload a new item, create a post or an event. So if you go down here, we can see that a post has already been created. Um, in order to see comments, you can do the drop down and collapse it for a cleaner look. Also, we see that Jane has uploaded two items. Um, each item has information and status of whether you want to give or share this image. So if we go down here um, to the drop down list. You can see uh, views for your events, your likes, your claims, and your messages. Um, over here, see who's interested is a list view of the items that people has claimed or liked. And let's go to search users. Currently, a search users is a list of all existing users. Um, for future iterations, I would like to implement a friend list so only your friends will be able to view your page. But um, currently, right now, you can see all users. So let's go to Emily Brown's page. You can see that Emily has an event, a post, and an image. So if you want to attend this event, you can hit attend and your name will be added to the list. And Jane should be, should see that on her end. So also, if you want to claim an item, you hit claim and it will be automatically listed in your claims page. You go back to Emily's page. And here you will see that the item has been claimed. So. Um, each item can be liked as many times um, as can be liked many times, but can only only be claimed once. So if we log out of Jane and log into Emily, you will be able to see um, that item in her. Um, see. In her list. Okay, so if we go to see who is interested, you see that Jane Doe has claimed it. So date, time stamped item, and you can go here. You can confirm it, which will send an automatic. Um, message out to Jane Doe and saying that this item has been confirmed. So let's go back. Okay, so, um, and that is, let's, we could go to my event, take a look at all the lists to see that Jane, um, you see Jane Doe was added to the event. Okay, let me go to my claims. Obviously, she doesn't have any claims right now, but um, and she doesn't have any likes either. Let's go here. Um, go to Jane Doe. 
can like here and it automatically take into my likes. So for future iterations, I um, would like to include a messaging um, in implement messaging in the app so that users can message each other within the app and um, without restricting it to automatic messages. And also, um, I would like to create a mobile app of this application as well. So um, users can um, um, access it on their phones. Um, and I think overall, um, I think this is a good tool. So um, if you have any questions or any suggestions to make this app a little better, please feel free to uh, visit my LinkedIn, um, send me a message, and we can chat about it. All right, thank you.